Welcome to Zilliqa Zebra's News Digest, where we summarize the latest news and updates on all things Zilliqa. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to Zilliqa Zebra to receive the latest digest of news and updates related to Zilliqa at your fingertips. Zilliqa Wallet is open and trading has begun on BigTracks.com for US citizens. This provides additional opportunities for US citizens to invest in Zilliqa. Zilliqa's Chief Commercial Officer Colin Miles represented Zilliqa in an interview with Digital Currency Summit where he spoke about Zilliqa's vision, how tokenization will change the world and more. Watch the interview at the following link. UFF Sports sold over 32 fantasy football franchises for over $1.2 million. Franchise owners operate much like the real world, overseeing all levels of their organization. Owners can be hands-off by hiring staff or hands-on with the day-to-day -day duties of running a professional fantasy franchise. The 10th wave of grantees for Zilhive's grants has been announced. They include exciting projects such as Demons, a centralized collectible NFT metaverse on Zilliqa blockchain, Unmarshall, an on-chain indexing protocol and Recap token, a decentralized news and content management system. Check out all of them at Zilliqa's official blog. Twitter user who let the dust out did an impressive infographic of the Zilliqa ecosystem. While it is not exhaustive, it gives a very clear view categorized by the core, DeFi, wallets and collaborations. To see a clearer view, check it out in my YouTube description below. Last but not least, Zilliqa has provided a chart which shows the key catalysts at certain points of the past year which might have led to spikes in fees. This shows how the team is working to boost on-chain activity. That's all I have for this edition of the Zilliqa Zebra News Digest. If you'd like me to cover any news, do PM me at my Twitter at Zilliqa Zebra. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for your regular dose of Zilliqa news. And check out my other videos which might be of interest to you.